cumpleaños feliz, cumpleaños feliz. ¡Pikachu! Hello? Ah, okay. Uh, Tapa tapap ya. Okay. Tapi I'm so thankful. And the reason is also just because of my dog. my channel it is your girl Jennifer Ross and I'm back at it again with yet another video today's video is gonna be a few days in my life it is currently Saturday as I'm starting off this vlog I worked the whole day I have the weekend shift and I just finished during my laundry break I washed my hair and I have deep conditioner in it I will be washing that out later Anyways, during my lunch break, I washed my hair. I have deep conditioner in it. I will be washing that out after I cooked dinner. So that's what I'm about to do. Today on the menu, we have chicken with pumpkin and rice. So I will be making that. But first, I have the kitchen to clean a little bit. I'm going to clean up, tidy up before I get started with that. But anyways... Um, Tomorrow I'm working as well. On Monday I have like a few errands to do because Tuesday is going to be Benny's birthday. So yeah, I will be including all of that in this vlog. Okay, but anyways, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe to my channel and we're going to go ahead and get into it. getting ready and now I'm gonna take a shower real quick 
and rinse out the deep conditioner that I have in my hair since this afternoon. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna do that real quick. Let's go. By the way, the deep conditioner that I have in my hair is the TGIM deep conditioner. If you watch my vlogs, my last vlogs, then you know that I'm obsessed with this. Obsessed. Super good. If you're looking for a good deep conditioner, this is the one. It's a little pricey though. $22.99 euros if you can, as you can see, but so, so worth it. By the way, I have like a little public service announcement. If you are someone who puts foil, aluminium foil, in your air fryer, you need to stop. A TikTok was sent to me by Angelica Jacobs, and she is one of the amigas. And she sent me this TikTok in which like someone's air fryer just exploded because she used foil in the air fryer. So I know I did that a lot of times in my video, so if you saw me do it or if you took it upon yourself to do it, I really recommend you to stop because I don't want anybody to have accidents or that thing for things to go bad. Like better be safe than sorry, so I thought I would say that today as well. I used the air fryer today and it's a little bit more work to clean it, but if you clean it right away, the oils and stuff, they don't get hard in the air fryer and it's still easier to clean it that way. So I would definitely recommend stop using foil in the air fryer. I told my mom that I did that and my mom was shocked. And it's clear that she doesn't watch all my videos, but she was shocked that I was doing that in the first place. She was like, you're not supposed to do that. I'm like, yeah, I know mom. I know, I found out now. But yeah, I won't be doing that anymore and neither should you, okay? I think I'm going to be putting on, maybe I'll put on my pajamas right away because I'm going to have dinner and then after that it's editing time because tomorrow is Sunday and I want to be able to upload my vlog after work hours. Um, I also want to apologize for the fact that tomorrow it's going to be a Papiamento vlog. By the time this video goes live, it's already happened. But I know that I said that I was going to post like the Bobby Minto vlogs on Friday. It is just too much for me to handle. I've been taking like a lot on my plate that I just physically am not able to handle at the moment. You know, it's just, yeah, I'm just not going to bite more off than I can chew anymore. So I'm going to try my best. I'm still going to try to keep that format for the most part. So yeah, I just wanted to quickly say that too. I said it also in the Bobby Minto vlogs. I'm trying, I'm gonna try to keep that format, but I can't promise you anything, you know, since it's just me. I have a full-time job next to this as well, because YouTube just doesn't pay all. Um, it's not enough yet for me to cover all my bills and stuff. So yeah, that is it, that is the skincare. It's a little dark in here, you know, but anyways. I'm gonna put on my pajamas and then put something in my hair, put some product in my hair. I'm planning on wearing it in a wig this week. I just wanna keep it nice and tucked away, so that's what I'm gonna be doing. Okay, we got pajamas are on. I have this striped little number on, and I'm quickly gonna <laughs> I look like a spider. Yeah, I'm quickly gonna apply some of this product in my hair. This is the double buttercream from SIM. And we want apply it to each section and twist it back up focusing the products mostly on the strengths of the, the length of the hair because for some reason I don't know if I really like this product anymore I really don't know if I still like this I'm almost out of this anyways like there's not much left in there so it is okay won't be committing to a whole jar of this anymore I think I like the twist and the finding one way better from uh, as I am so that might be my new go-to. This works way better also on blow-dried hair. If you're doing like a twist out on blow-dried blow hair, I feel like it works way better on that as well. Okay. Yeah? Ethan? 
Aiden? Yes. Okay, come in. Put some of that in my edges as well, you know. Because we don't want crusty edges. Putting it back in a clip and letting it dry for the rest of the night. Okay, this is hair all done. Let's go eat. what is up it is now monday i had pretty much a slow morning i already showered i got my skincare done my body care done all of that and i'm now about to start doing my makeup today i have a few errands that i need to run because tomorrow is benny's birthday and i want to fix him some stuff to bake him a cake yeah i'm gonna do cupcakes this time for his birthday and i want to try to find him something nice i'm not really sure what yet because he we're going on vacation this year and that is going to be like the birthday present for the both of us for the most part he has a lot of fragrances and stuff and I am not really sure what he has on his wish list right now. I think like a few Tom Ford perfumes, but I'm not really 100% sure. So yeah, I want to fix him something nice. I don't know what yet. We'll see. Uh, I also need to get my subscription for the bus and train renewed um, because it's a new year and I haven't done that yet. And it expires on the 4th of March and it's now the last day of february as i'm filming this so yeah i need to go do all of that um and yeah i think i'm gonna get ready i've been enjoying so much like colorful makeup lately um but today i think i want to keep things like a little bit more subtle maybe something with gold or rose gold would be cute i'm not sure and i saw like this technique with a spoon i'm gonna try and do that and yeah i'm just gonna show you some b-roll of me doing my makeup but I'm not going to make it too difficult. I want to have fun with it, but I don't want this to take too much time. So, yeah, let's do my makeup. This turns out good because I do not know about this. It's not even that much of a crazy color, but I haven't done looks like this in a while. That spoon technique, I don't know. I like it, but at the same time, maybe I didn't use the right colors for that. But at the same time, I'm gonna throw on some lashes and lashes will fix everything. I'm gonna also do some eyeliner maybe and then it will look good, whatever. It's whatever. Yeah, this is a lot. <laughs> this looks crazy. Yo, I'm gonna continue doing this. We'll see how this turn out. I'll check in with you later. <laughs> My makeup is kind of a lot. I don't do this every day. Like, I don't know. I don't know if I like it. And this is also the reason why I don't try new things anymore. Because every time I try new things, I end up looking extra like this. And this, <laughs> this is just to go renew my subscription for the bus and train. Like, come on now. Come on. I didn't have to look this extra. I like it, but at the same time, I'm like, pre-pandemic, I would just rock this and move on with my day maybe i just need to get used to it again but anyways i am thinking of wearing these earrings i have these on now and i like them 
like gold hoops, simple. But I also have these hoops from Lovelies by Lulu. Let me share them with you. They say abundant in them. And I think like maybe I should wear these because these are a little bit more fun, you know? Since we're already being extra today, might as well. So I'm gonna change it up. Yes, I'm just sitting here in my bra. So I gotta be a little bit careful with not flashing you. Abundant, it needs to be this way then. Oh, and it has like a green little crystal. I just noticed that. So cute. I'm obsessed. This girl is so talented. All the things she's making, I love. Oh my God, I gotta make some pictures before I leave the house. This is cute, like, look. Yes, I'm obsessed, I love it. It says abundant, oh my God. Cute. Okay, I'm gonna put on my outfit and then I'll show you what I'm wearing today. Amiga, I'm finally at the bus stop waiting for the bus. Hopefully I don't have to wait too long, but I'm gonna head to the city first, get the subscription thing done. And then after that, I'm gonna move on to the other errands that I need to get done. So yeah. something before I get my errands done. So yeah, at McDonald's I ordered a McChicken menu with iced tea and fries. I mean, size of fries. Gonna eat this, enjoy this, and yeah. my subscription for the bus and train and I'm now on my way to Zara I'm gonna do the Zara here in the city see if they have something that I want and then after that I'm gonna go do groceries buy cupcake stuff and then I think we're done for the day but I think it's spring break or something even though it's not spring yet but it's so busy everywhere children everywhere <laughs> I'm at Zara in the fitting rooms uh, It is so so busy But I'm surprised because this is Everything that I found Like I'm working on my Curacao wardrobe I'm gonna be trying Them on, sharing with you how it looks And yeah, let's go Okay, Amiga, here we have The first dress It's cute, but it's so It's a little bit short on the back I don't know if I like that But it is cute though And it fits and the back is all open so I'm not really sure if this one is for me but it is cute though 
Okay, next up we have this green little number. It is mommy vibes. Like with the wear the right undergarments. Ooh. Okay, and now we have this one. It's really nice, really pretty, but I think I have something that already looks like this. So I think it's gonna be a no based on that. But here we have the last thing that I'm gonna try on. And this is so cute. But where am I gonna wear this? I thought it had like sleeves. But this, like where am I gonna wear this? Where? It is a vibe though. It's really really cute. Look at this. Oh, this gives me photo shoot vibes. So cute. But yeah, I have nowhere to wear this to be very honest with you. So I'm not gonna do it and it's not cheap. So no, nope, we're not gonna do this. But it is beautiful. It's more like a cape blazer. If you have an occasion for this in your plus size, come get it. 90 euros, Zara. Okay, amiga, I finished doing everything that I had to do and now I'm on my way to go get the bus to go home. I even bought cupcakes for Benny just in case if I don't feel like making them when I'm go when I go home because trust me I know myself the best uh, there is a big chance that I get home and I'm not in the mood anymore to bake anything so I wanted to have something as a backup and uh, if I decide to not bake anything tonight I will bake them for him to bring to work for his colleagues the next day so that's also gonna be fine then I will be doing that tomorrow but we'll see but now I'm on my way home it's been fun and good to be out but i feel a little tired so time to go home Cumpleaños feliz, cumpleaños feliz, cumpleaños, cumpleaños, cumpleaños feliz. Y pip pip pip, hurra! ¿Viste esa grabación de yoga? Pip. Happy birthday, Dishi. Make a wish. Ya va a drive, ya va a drive, Happy birthday! Mm -hmm. Yeah? Oh. <laughs> Happy birthday, Benny! Thank you, Jamie! Cheers! 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 Alright, amiga, it is 12 o'clock and it's Benny's birthday! Yay! Cheers, Benny! Cheers, Benny. We're gonna have a little cupcake and then after that. Oh, we're also watching um, Inventing, Anna. Inventing Anna, so we're gonna watch like a few more episodes and then after that we're gonna go to bed. But, happy birthday, Benny! Happy birthday, Benny! Happy birthday! <laughs>
is now the next day and today is Benny's birthday! Woo! He's currently in the shower. I'm gonna eat my breakfast and then after that I'm gonna get ready for the day. Um, yeah, that's it. That's basically it. So yeah, I'll talk to you after I'm ready for the day. Okay, amiga, I finished getting ready uh, and we're about to leave the house. I'm wearing an all black outfit today and I'm wearing Jordans on the bottom. I will show you when we go outside. This is the makeup that I did today, like simple, my everyday type of shit. But I feel really good in this and that's the reason that I do it every day, I guess. But yeah, I wasn't feeling doing crazy stuff today. So simple, simple, simple. Yeah, I'm ready to go. Let's do it. what is up it is now the next day and i'm with my sister what did you do baby boo yesterday i didn't vlog that much because benny just wanted to celebrate it on the download his birthday so we did what he wanted because it's his birthday and today i am with my sister she came to visit me it's been a while huh yeah we've seen each other yes, yes. It's been a while since we've seen each other, so today was a great day to meet up. But we're gonna do some sightseeing, more like touristy stuff. And later in the day, we are also gonna go to Shoe Cafe. And you know, just have a fun a little sister day. I thought I would include this as well in this vlog. At this point, I don't even know what this vlog is. I'm not sure what this vlog looks like, but we'll see. Yeah. <laughs> um, um, yeah. I don't know. But anyways, we're gonna make this a fun day. And yeah, we're now at Starbucks at the station waiting for our order. I already received my croissant and now we're just waiting for our drinks. So yeah, my sister's gonna pick up the drinks. Yeah, it costs me overwhelming and the honey drink. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's a little overwhelming for the lady. It is not that busy, but she's all alone and she's panicking a little bit. Anyways, we or I have a caramel macchiato and my sister has a chai tea latte and we're gonna enjoy it. having our little coffee and now we are heading to the graffiti graffiti graffitis I think it's graffiti to the graffiti street okay so yeah and my sister wants to move everywhere where she feels good vibes so I figured I would walk with her Literally everywhere <laughs> yes oh I like Spain I want to move yeah Spain. I'm gonna move to Spain <laughs> looking into houses to find in Spain so I thought like maybe she can look into houses here. So I'm gonna take her to this nice street with beautiful houses and see That's if she finds camera. anything. Yes.
Okay, amiga, we are now at the Graffiti Street and it is so cool. I've been here so many times, but my sister has not. Um, but still, like so many new graffitis and so beautiful. The people are so talented. Like what? But yeah, it's so fun. I think we're gonna head to the city shortly. So yeah. we are now in the city doing some sightseeing I'm having so much fun I'm sorry that I'm not, not I'm sorry that I'm not talking that much but I just want to spend some time with my sis seeing pretty stuff like look at this look look how beautiful that is it's so pretty Is it farting? No, it's <laughs> clapping for you. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Okay. My that's We got sangrias. Cheers, amiga. Cheers. <laughs> I feel like such a rebel. I feel like I'm in Barcelona or something. Day that, yeah, day drinking. That's the only place where I do those type of things. Drinking sangria in the middle of the day. Living my best life. Living my life. Living my life. Hopefully I don't stop start acting crazy after this. Because I'm a lightweight. But you come at a point in life where you just need to live it, okay? And that's where we at. That's hey, where we hey. at. <laughs> <laughs> One step forward, two steps backwards, yeah. Party straw and everything. Hey, I love this. This is all you need in life. Like, hey. Salute, amiga, salute. Sal salute. Minti y una tete. Minti. ¿Cómo se llama? La democracia. Haciendo nada. La andamos atrás. Vaya, un poco. So, what I get? Beastie pie and salica. Ah, mira. Baby mother, bro. Sí. Ay, amiga, se hace sangría la papia. Hello? Ah, ok. Está por la papia. Ok. ¿Está familiaridad? ¿Qué es para que nada me Esta salinha. Esta salinha. Esta salinha, amiga. Eh, amiga, salen de bebé con que mucho lío. Tengo un slow down. Amiga, el cote se quita, la verdad. Mm. Oh, yeah. Está seco, botí, cuánta porra, puta, güey. ¿Sabes qué cote es más bueno? Un tiki. Amiga, dale, como en esta shot. El cote es más bueno en esta juice. A mí me gusta que se diga, porque me está grabando mucho lío. No a bebe como los indas que mueve fuma. Ok, sorry. A vos te vas a decir, pero no vi sin das que mueve fuma si va a ser muy grande. Para nada, no se entiende que hace ni un mamá. Ya no puedo ver lo que hace. Que no se entiende que aquí está, porque hay como no sangría. Ah, bueno. Of course. We're gonna enjoy this. I think we're gonna do a little walk in the castle there. And then after that, we're gonna have to shoot cafe. We came here for <laughs> we came here for the Ferris wheel, but I think because of Eunice, 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 whatever, and her boyfriend Franklin, they have to take it away. Because if that thing would have tumbled, that would have been bad. 
and she was so rude that storm. She was so rude. She would have tumbled it. Jelly, eh? What about the lightweight? Mm. <laughs> 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 Working for your shit, if you don't get doing what you're supposed to do, you it ain't giving. Hey, Ooh. ring ring, is that tequila? <laughs> such a good day seriously what a good day is this beautiful it's a perfect day sun is good like you know temperatures are amazing this is all I need this is all I, I need come on okay. sangria is gone I'm eating the ice cubes now oh, fuck you I am not drunk <laughs> Cafe, my favorite cafe in Antwerp and we already ordered and yeah we're having such a good day aren't we mm -hmm. we're having such a good day I'm so happy that my sister is here now it's time for something sweet and nice with sugar and spice I kind of cried <laughs> but I'm back I'm okay it's just really nice I didn't see that coming okay um, but yeah my food is here this is my food What is up, amiga? It is now the next day. I just finished making myself a latte and I'm about to start editing this vlog. I do want to thank you so much for watching, for all your support. I see all of you, so thank you so, so much. I can't express how thankful I am. 
I, I just can't. I don't have the words to express it. Like I'm so, so thankful. This has been like an eventful week with me feeling like in a rut and everything. But now things are going way, way better. Uh, I'm working on things. I'm working on my videos, working on my consistency and all of that. It can be worse because at least I'm posting one time a week. So yeah, at least that. Benny's birthday was this week. You wanted to spend it like more privately. So I, that is why I wasn't able to vlog that much on that day. However, um, we did book our flight to Curacao. <coughs> yes, we do have our tickets. Oh my God, what did I do? Look at this. So yeah, we do have our tickets and we are officially going. So I am so excited about that. I really, really <coughs> need this vacation and an actual vacation. Uh, I think like everything with the pandemic and everything, it has just been taking its toll on me because pre-pandemic we used to do like two or three vacations a year and now it's really difficult to do that. So I am just in need. I'm in need of a real vacation. And finally, it is happening. So yeah, I will be doing a meet and greet on Curacao as well. I will like announce the date in the next vlog, I think. Yeah, in the next vlog will be the best thing to do that. Yeah, a lot of good things. We booked a vacation. I saw my sister yesterday. We celebrated my birthday at Chu Cafe, which had me a little emotional just because like I feel so, so thankful for everything and everyone that I have in my life, for all of you guys, for this platform that I have that people even care to see what my day looks like and the things the crazy things that i do like i don't know i never thought i would be this person and i just want to thank you so much it never goes by unappreciated and i feel like i'm getting a little teary again but i'm just so thankful you know i'm so thankful and the reason is also just because oh my god I finished studies that I didn't even want to pursue a career in. Like, it's so many things. And all those things have been crossing my mind lately. Oh my god, how embarrassing. Crying on the internet for no reason. <sighs> but anyways, I want to thank you so much for all the support. It means so much to me. You have no idea. Like, it's just the tiniest comment, the tiniest thumbs up, anything, you know? It means the world to me. So I don't know. I don't know why I'm, why I'm crying over that. Because there's really, literally, I promise you I'm okay. But I've just been feeling really, really thankful. And for example, yesterday, they had like a menu going on at True Cafe. And it was called their deluxe menu or something. And it said that if you order the deluxe menu, it comes with fireworks we didn't and my sister and i didn't end up ordering the deluxe menu because we were a little full and we just wanted like something sweet and something to drink and that be it so we didn't want to waste all the food that would come with the deluxe menu so we decided to go with something smaller and then when they came with like our our plates and the fireworks and also just like the happy birthday song i really in that moment i really felt like so thankful like who am i at this point like I don't know. I just wanted to give you the message to always be kind. Uh, you don't know how much that can brighten someone's day. Support where you can because during the pandemic we have all been through our things and even like Shoe Cafe for example, I've always been a loyal supporter just because I love the concept. The people are so so nice that work there. They have always welcomed me and yeah, it's just it's just a lot, you know? It might be something really simple, being nice and everything, but like being nice can bring you so, so far in life, you know? It's, if they were shitty people, I wouldn't be going every time. If they were shitty people, I wouldn't have supported them all the time. And it goes for everyone actually, because I truly believe that people keep supporting them because they are so welcoming, so nice, so kind, and the food is good, the drinks are great, the ambiance, is amazing and just that little firework thing it just put me in a mindset like wow i have so much to be grateful for you know i have so much i have so much to be grateful for that's just what 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 that was about you know 
so yeah i don't want this to get like too long and everything but yeah thank you so much for watching this video i promise you i'm okay i uh, need to get my period as well so maybe that's also the reason why i feel a little bit emotional about everything but yeah when you think you're having a shitty time or things aren't going your way just sit down and think about all the things that you have to be grateful for you know even write them all down write down all the things that you have and that you can be grateful for we live in a society where we always are chasing a new high like you reach one milestone and then there's another milestone and there's another milestone and it doesn't hurt to just stand still and be in the moment and be thankful for the milestone that you have reached because there was a certain point that this milestone whatever it may be for you that you were standing there and being like oh my god i so desperately want to be there and then it's such a shame that when we reach the milestone we just brush it over and on to the next one so be grateful for your milestones. It's important to keep consistency and to keep going, but be grateful for the things that you already have going on and the things that you already worked so hard for because they are all worth it. You know, they all need to be celebrated, every little milestone. So yeah, thank you so much for your support. <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and leave a nice comment down below. And I hope to see you soon in my next video. Mwah! Bye, amiga!